Let's get over to your first alert weather with the one and only Ann <laughs> Listen, we've got kind of some changes coming our way this weekend. Yeah, you know, a little rain uh, for at least one of the two weekend days. It's not going <laughs> to be a washout, though, so we don't have to be concerned about that in any of those watch parties on Sunday. Uh, you'll be just fine as far as the rain is concerned. It will be cooler, though, than what we're experiencing right now. East Fort Worth is sitting at 61. We've got an east southeast wind at eight miles an hour. The clouds have been kind of streaming up from the south today, so we've Notice that cloud cover increase. And then there's been a little bit of light rain activity in Henderson, Anderson, Freestone, Limestone counties today. Dominus put that 10 to 20 percent chance into the forecast earlier this morning. If you were watching, then nothing severe, just light rain. This is all going to kind of kick out of here, continue pushing off to the east as we head through the next couple of hours. But the clouds continue to build in from the south. And then for tomorrow morning, we've got a few showers in the forecast. This is Way overdone. It's picking up on the fact that there's some moisture in place, a lot of cloud cover. I've got the rain chances at about 30% for most of us here in North Texas. So, in fact, that means that a lot of us aren't going to see rain tomorrow. I think chances are going to be best the farther south and east you are. And then you notice as we head into the afternoon and this cold front makes its approach, you get a brief peak of sunshine. Then overnight, that cold front continues to push off to the east. We have a little bit of cloud cover lingering Sunday morning, but by Sunday afternoon, I think it's mostly sunny. But look at these lows once this front swings through. 37 Sunday morning, 35 Monday morning, and especially with Sunday behind that cold front, you're going to have a northwest wind. And the feels like temperatures are going to be in the upper 20s and low 30s. So a very chilly Sunday morning, Sunday afternoon. It's where we're supposed to be. We're expecting those temperatures to top out in the mid 50s. And then, of course, we get to Monday. We've got sunshine with a high of 60 degrees. So Monday is dry. During the day, once we get into the evening, the rain chances start to pick up. And then Tuesday, rain coverage at 90%. So I know what you want to know. Is there going to be snow? Right now, we are still forecasting just a cold rain. We're going to watch for some snow potentially mixing in a little farther to the west, but we're not looking at the temperatures being cold enough, at least with our forecast right now, to see any bit of accumulation. So we'll keep an eye on it. It is going to get cold, though 47 on Tuesday, 50 on Wednesday, and some decent rain. We haven't talked about rain, really seen rain all month, and we're looking at a widespread one to two inches of rainfall between what we see late Monday and in to Tuesday. So it's a cold, rainy day on Tuesday. We're likely going to issue a first alert weather day, so stay tuned for that. Once we get to Wednesday and Thursday, we've got lows around freezing, highs in the 50s in the afternoon. Nicole, finally below normal.